Hi everyone, uh, Darren McHugh here from InnoPharma Technology and we're at Acoma 2022 and I want to take this opportunity to show you our Icon system as well as the new software version 3 of iPass and some of its new features. So um, this is the Icon 2, some of you may be familiar with it. It's our real-time non-product contact particle size and shape analyzer. So here's the unit here. Inside this we have a camera and an illumination source pulsing light into this material that we're measuring here, this bulk solid. The Icon can measure materials between the size range of 50 microns to 5,500 microns. But if I go from, let's say, the hardware over to the software, what we can see here is iPass, and this is our newest version of iPass, version 3. We can see the images here being reported in real time, um, and they're getting broken down for their particle size and shape, and reported over here on the right with these trend lines. Um, the software is interactive, so if I hover over these charts, you can see the D10, the D50, and the D90 particle size results. And this could be really useful in a process environment where you want to monitor maybe uh, quality control, you're trying to get an end product uh, profile of a certain particle size, or you want to modify your process, maybe uh, improve the yield or improve efficiency or speed of the process. This is really where measuring particle size in line in real time has its advantages. Uh, actually, one of the hardware pieces I have over here that I uh, should have mentioned is one of our integrations and this just shows a window that the icon can measure through that's typically what we do to measure materials in a non-product contact fashion so you mount the unit here and we also have some fouling control solutions for certain processes that might um, uh, 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 block the windows for measurement etc and we offer these off the shelf, shelf solutions as well a few of the new things about version 3 of the software, we've added in scale bars here that are customizable to any size you want, so you can get a gauge of what uh, the size of the material is in this image area. We've also added an auto scale to the x-axis of this um, uh, distribution bar here. And if I click that there, you can actually customize it to, to zoom in maybe on a feature of interest there. So that's great. Um, the auto scale is a really useful feature. And then the other thing that's happening with version 3 of iPass is we put in AI in the form of machine learning. So what's happening in the back end here is um, we've got images that have been trained for uh, accurate particle size detection. And what that's done for us is it's allowed us to open this up to a lot wider range of materials. We can now measure bulk solids in the form of crystals or shiny material, reflective materials such as glass beads or sugar, for example. So there's a whole new range of materials that you can now measure with the um, iPass version 3. And if I show you a little bit behind the scenes of what that looks like for our image analysis, We can see the images here are being reported back and then we get a breakdown image here of the mask of the thresholds that are being successfully matched for particle size. If I open that one for you. You can see the different colors here are the masks being overlaid on the materials and then an equivalent ellipse has been fitted to it for its major and minor axis so we can project the volume measurement from that. And all that's been done in the back end in real time of the system. That's about it for uh, the iPass system and version three of the software. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video, um, hearing about Icon 2. Um, if you want to find out more information, please visit our website, innopharmatechnology.com.